The battle over Bennett College in Greensboro is heating up. The school has to come up with $5 million in about 50 days, or it could lose its accreditation, essentially shutting its doors. It's one of only two all-female HBCUs in the country. Although it won't be an easy task, students we spoke to believe there's still time to save their school. Will Bennett College open its doors to students and staff next fall? That's the question after the Southern Association of Colleges and Schools Commission on Colleges, or SACS, announced this week the school will be removed from its membership. I immediately started crying because it's like, what am I going to do as a junior? Where do I go next? The future for students like junior Ebony Dwell and sophomore Diane Patterson is unclear. If Bennett loses accreditation, the school might be forced to close and credits might not transfer. I don't want to lose hope now. I don't want to look into anything else now because I have faith that we will push through. School leaders say the decision from Sachs caught them off guard. There's no one way to demonstrate fiscal stability, which is why we thought we we were demonstrating fiscal stability. The school has struggled the last few years because of declining enrollment and lack of financial resources. And even with the surplus of money last year, it wasn't enough to overcome the down years. There's now a push to crowdsource $5 million to help save the school. To have that taken away, it's like you're taking away a big chunk of history. And you don't want people to forget about what happened here at Bennett. And you don't want to just become one of those places that people are like, oh yeah, that used to be a school, but it's not anymore. And so we are asking the Greensboro community, the state of North Carolina, and the nation to help us achieve this task. It can be done. We've done it before. Bennett College is appealing the decision and will keep its accreditation during that process. Students and staff will be able to stay at least through next semester.